Christians consider Christ to be the living waters, right? Christ is the living waters. And the very first words in the Bible uh, in Genesis contain water. And in the beginning, there was nothing. And then God moved over the face of the waters. So there was no light. There was no sound. There was no creation. There was none of that. But there was God. Excuse me. There was God and there was water. And God moved over the face of the water, showing that that water had a face, meaning it was fundamentally a, a being, a conscious living entity with a face. Well, what happens when you look into the face of water? You see your own reflection, right? So we were created as reflections of our creator. We were created in the mirror image of our creator, according to the Bible. And for the first many, 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 many millions of years, there were no mirrors. The only mirror was water. And so when we look at water, we, we see God. And when God looked in the face of the waters, he saw himself and, and created everything in that mirror image through the consciousness and the movement of water. And so that was the very first lines in Genesis. And also the very last line in Revelation as well. Water was the first thing mentioned and water is the last thing mentioned. The very last line in Revelation, it says, um, and I will give the living waters to all of those who are thirsty. So he speaks often, God and Christ both speak often throughout the Bible about the living waters 